An archaeologist has discovered a tiny mummy, and these Egyptian sarcophaguses are going to be open for the first time. From giant animals to unique discoveries that science still can't explain. Don't forget to subscribe and hit the bell. May it bring you lots of luck. Remember the silence from Doctor Who? Now look at this. These skulls were found by archaeologists in the Caucasus. They were found in a chest on which there was the emblem of a German occult organization known as Anna Nerba. The organization existed in the 1940s, and its purpose was to search for mystical relics. Judging by the shapes of the skulls, the beings to whom these remains belonged were definitely horned and walked on two legs. They also lacked mouths, having instead small holes on the sides of their heads. Who these skulls belonged to, and exactly what the Ananerba were looking for in the Caucasus, remains a mystery to scientists. A cave containing 17 tiny coffins was accidentally discovered in Scotland. Each was less than 10 centimeters long. They could easily fit in the palm of your hand. They were nailed down with boot nails, and inside each coffin was a carved male figurine wearing sewn clothes. Some figurines were missing one or both arms. Who made them and why is still not clear. Perhaps they were part of a magical ritual like voodoo dolls. Thai archaeologists found the bones of a huge animal a few kilometers from Bangkok. The head alone measured 3 meters long, and the entire skeleton was 12 meters long. Scientists have already managed to extract 80% of the skeleton and assume that these are the remains of a Brita's whale, which lived about 5,000 years ago. This discovery may serve as proof that a few thousand years ago, part of Southeast Asia was completely covered with water. The next Lara Croft level discovery was made in Egypt. In 2019, archaeologists discovered 30 wooden sarcophaguses with mummies in them, which had simply been buried at Al Asasif Cemetery 3,000 years ago, but they were preserved in excellent condition. The coffins lay one on top of the other several layers deep and were discovered quite by accident. It had become the largest discovery in Egypt in the past century until 2020 when archaeologists found another secret burial with 59 sarcophaguses. Scientists have discovered chambers in the ancient necropolis of Saqqara at depths of 10, 11, and 12 meters completely filled with intact sarcophaguses. All the mummies have been preserved in perfect condition, despite the fact that they are over 2,600 years old. On the sarcophaguses themselves, there still remained paint and wax, which had originally been rubbed on to make them shine. Scientists have not yet been able to establish the identity of these tombs. This small mummy found in the Chilean Atacama Desert has haunted scientists around the world for almost 20 years. The skeleton is only 15 centimeters long, and its unusually elongated skull suggests alien origins. But DNA analysis has shown that this was indeed a human, but scientists still can't explain the anomaly of its appearance. In 2020, during excavations of an Egyptian tomb near Aswan, archaeologists discovered the body of a crocodile in the sand. At first, they didn't think much about the discovery, but further excavations showed that this was a mass grave of 11 mummified crocodiles. They had lain in the sand for about 2,500 years. The purpose behind burying these reptiles has remained a mystery for scientists. Earlier in Egypt, there had already been discoveries of several mummified crocodiles, which had pieces of beef in their stomachs. Archaeologists believe that crocodile mummies could have been sacrificed to Sobek, the Egyptian god with the head of a crocodile. It's a good thing we don't live alongside dinosaurs, but maybe that wasn't always the case. As evidenced by some mysterious ceramic figurines found near the Mexican city of Acambaro in 1944. These 33,000 figurines were made some 5,000 years ago, but the most stunning part about them is that most of them depict dinosaurs. No one's supposed to have known about dinosaurs at that time, because their existence wasn't discovered until the 19th century. But some of the figures resemble UFOs too, so maybe that's the key. 
During road repairs in downtown Huyuan, China, workers found 43 fossilized eggs. It turned out that they had been lying in the ground for 70 million years. 19 of the eggs were still in excellent condition. Some were up to 13 centimeters in diameter. Scientists believe that these eggs belong to an unknown dinosaur species. And hopefully their mom isn't swimming around nearby. Harry Potter found the resurrection stone inside the snitch, but British student Aaron Smith was even luckier. While walking along the beach, he found a mysterious rock slightly smaller than a soccer ball. When the students split it in two, inside was a fossil of a very rare marine mollusk that lived on Earth 185 million years ago. And on the outside, it was covered with golden pyrite, which meant it could be polished to become golden. Archaeologists often find mummies of cats in Egypt, but this 2,500-year-old find was given an MRI test and the results were shocking. It turned out that inside the cat mummy were five hind legs, three tails, zero ribs, and instead of a head, a ball of wool. What could it be? Write in the comments. Near the Egyptian Luxor, archaeologists found the oldest prosthesis in history. A prosthetic big toe made of wood and leather was found on the leg of a mummy of a woman buried in 950 BC. The quality of the work is simply amazing considering the level of medicine at that time. Scientists in France have found a dinosaur thigh bone whose gigantic size is quite impressive. It's two meters long, which is taller than the average man, and it weighs 500 kilograms. Yeah, that's two Harley Davidsons with Mickey Rourke and his girlfriend on them. Scientists were very surprised at the bone's excellent condition, and there were even still traces of tendon on it. They can only assume that the bone belonged to the largest class of dinosaurs, the sauropods, which reached 20 meters in height. The inhabitants of a Chinese village have discovered the remains of a dragon. The skeleton is 18 meters long and shaped like a very large snake with a horned dragon head. Scientists have not commented on this discovery, but according to the internet, it's a fake. I just hope it isn't Falcor from The NeverEnding Story. If Titan of Bravos from Game of Thrones wants to play soccer, then Bosnia and Herzegovina has the right ball for him. That's where archaeologists discovered in a forest a giant ball of basalt and iron weighing 37 tons and measuring 3 meters across. Look at the size of it compared to this girl. There are still many similar but smaller balls in this forest. Geologists believe that small rocks attracted solid particles until they grew into enormous balls, but other experts are certain that these huge stone sculptures were created by an unknown ancient Balkan civilization. If these stone giants from The Hobbit need cookware, then welcome to the Valley of the Pitchers in Laos. After all, thousands of huge stone pitchers were found here, which are 3 meters tall and weigh 6 tons. Scientists still have no idea how the containers ended up here and what they were used for. The most popular theories claim that these pitchers were used to collect rainwater or as a crematorium. Well, that's all for today. Write in the comments about your strange discoveries, and I'll go look for something in the yard. Don't forget to like the video, and we'll see you soon.